to hear more details of that plan. A new report says that hotels here in Hawaii are headed towards economic recovery. Dallas Monteveros joins us live from the Royal Hawaiian on What's Ahead. Good morning, Dallas. Good morning, Christine and Kelly. Yep, we've been talking about this throughout Wake Up Today, now into the Take Two show. And we've been learning a lot about this report from the American Hotel and Lodging Association, from the different adjustments to the hardships and obstacles to the numbers we're seeing now compared to 2019 pre-pandemic and also the new traveler concept that, that, that really sticks out in this report. And here to tell us more about it, we have our friend Keikoa McClellan with the American Hotel and Lodging Association. Hey, Keikoa. Aloha kaka here. Again, thank you so much for having us this morning, Dallas. Oh, it's been awesome here at the beautiful Royal Hawaiian Hotel. And we've been talking about this report throughout the morning. And one thing that really sticks out to us, again, is that new traveler concept. And people are looking for more ways to have an impact when it comes to getting out of this pandemic. Do you want to show or share more with what we need to know? Sure, Dallas, it's really simple. And it's okay. something that we in the Hawaii's hotel and lodging industry, representatives of AHLA and our partners at the Hawaii Hotel Alliance have been doing for decades. And that's curating authentic experiences for our visitors. It's not just about sand and surf. It's about the story of Kamehameha Nui and his home here at the Royal Hawaiian, a luxury collection hotel. And, and Helumoa, the beautiful coconut grove that was again home to some of our ali'i. And more importantly, it's about the actual connection between our properties, our members, and the communities that we serve. When you stay at the Royal Hawaiian, you're actually contributing to native Hawaiian education here in the islands. When you stay at some of our properties across the Waikiki landscape, you contribute to organizations like the, the Queen Liliuokalani Trust and the Queen Emma Land Foundation that, that supports our, our primary health care provider here in Hawaii, the Queen's Health Systems. We're very proud of our legal visitor industry's contributions to keeping Hawaii safe and keeping our communities healthy and thriving. And so we make sure we share those messages with our guests. Kate Koa, thank you so much for joining us here on Wake Up Today and Take Two, not only giving us some information about this new report, but also some insight to the industry. We appreciate it. The pleasure is ours. And if you want some more details about this report, head over to our website, Little Today at khon2.com. You can get some more information. Reporting here at the Royal Hawaiian Hotel, Dallas Navarro's K2 News, work for Hawaii. Dallas, thank you. 836 right now. Coming up next on this Taco Tuesday, we're checking out authentic Mexican street tacos and so much more. So excited for this. I'm already so hungry.